Dak Shepard and Kristen Bell are keeping it real once again. The famous couple made a virtual appearance on The Drew Barrymore Show on Wednesday and answered some rapid-fire questions that shed new insight into their life together. During the segment, Dax revealed that his previous long-term open relationship let the Good Place star to get jealous when they first started dating. My wife's incredibly confident, as she should be. There was a ton of jealousy at the beginning of the relationship for pretty, you know, good reasons. I had never, I had been in an open relationship for nine years. Um, I was blacked out a big chunk of my life. Uh, you know, there were a lot of things for her to be concerned about, but I'd say once we um, got engaged, some kind of switch for me seemed to change. And I find her to be incredibly not jealous, which is a very hot characteristic in a partner. In another segment, the 41-year-old mom of two admitted she was initially nervous about getting in a relationship with the 46-year-old armchair expert host. But she added that she is a big believer in growth and second chances. And in the beginning, it was nerve wracking dating Dax, knowing, you know, his history of recovery and, and that he's just this big force. But I was like, no, he's got it inside of him. He's got all his goodness. And I have been proven right. Yeah. Because nobody is more affectionate with our I'm not even as affectionate with our girls as he is. And hopefully they'll grow up, you know, healthier and happier and safer. Dax and Kristen are never shy about the ups and downs of making their marriage work, and they've always lived their love story their way. In October, the pair chatted exclusively with Access Hollywood at the launch of their Hello Bello diaper factory in Waco, Texas, and took a trip down memory lane, recalling their courthouse wedding and the night Dax proposed. What's Wait. great is Kristen's mother knows our anniversary date, uh -huh. you know, by rope. Yeah. So she generally sends us a text the day before that says, happy anniversary, and we both go like, oh, right. And, and we call each other, so thank goodness for Because neither mom. of us remember, so we're never angry at each other. Simply because there's a reason. It's not like we don't give a rip. It's because we had been engaged for so long, and we were waiting for Doma to get overturned. So then when that happened, it just was a course of action that we got. It wasn't like we planned some date it, had we planned a wedding like September 18th, I bet we would remember yeah, it forever. Yeah, but yeah. literally, it was like, oh, the courthouse is open today. Let's shoot over there. You got to work later. You have a love scene with our best friend, <laughs> Ryan Hansen. So we got to knock this out before that. Was awkward. But we do remember that it was in October because the couple photos we took at the courthouse had like scary ghouls and stuff in the yes, background. Yes, that's how so we, that's how we're like, oh, shoot, it's October. I feel like we got, have, it, this must be our anniversary month. And what do you remember about proposing? Do you remember anything from that day? It was very memorable. Everything. It was Christmas Day. I had just flown back from Michigan to pick up his parents. I was exhausted. And we had this wonderful Christmas Day, and I had previously planned to go to this restaurant that I had first said I love you at, and yet this day was so wonderful. And I was crying. I started crying in bed. I was like, I'm just so grateful. I love your parents, and I'm happy to be with you, and it's Christmas, and I'm over and then I walked nude into the closet where I had hidden the ring and, and I was the jacket. Like, where are you going? And then I returned naked and, and, and kneeled down naked and uh, and hit her with it. And then I was just, you thought I was crying And then crying we woke before. up the next morning, I went to get coffee, and my mom was in the kitchen. She said, oh, no, you guys, did you have a big fight? I heard Kristen sobbing. <laughs> I said, oh, no, no, we're getting married.